Hello, Dr. Yardy. Hello, public speech class. It's me, Keith Lewis, and I'll be back with my persuasive speech. Now, everybody loves music, don't they? They they just enjoy turning it up, tuning out everything. But did you know there's some consequences to this? Now, really, the point I'd like to get across is to turn it down. So some of the dangers of of headphones and with extremely loud music is, will include ear damage, speaker damage, um, class disruption, and risks of injury. Now, it, with this, with these causes, I mean, does this already make you want to turn it down maybe just a couple notches, maybe? Because with this, this being my point, I noticed also there's been a lot, a lot of research done with what these headphones do to teens nowadays. I mean, it's already making me lose my own hearing for the matter. Ear damage. Now with this, your MP3 players or iPods, guys, they're, if you have them up all the way, that's 120 decibels. 120 decibels is equal to that of a rock concert. And with that, within, after an hour and a half of having it that loud for that, for, for that duration, you have already started losing your hearing. You are in the process of it. And with this fact was actually found through the American Osteopathic Association, which does research on medical needs such as ears. Like in this case, so here's your headphones. They'll be lodged into here. And it'll travel in and it hits an eardrum. That eardrum can only take so much of the sound waves and with all that pressure building up, it's going to break it. And after tapping the smart board, this leads to my, my next thing. Who loves speakers? Sort of like the, who, who loves having speakers like this one right here? It, my JBL. And also having your headphones, your really nice ones. Yeah, I know you do. <laughs> um, speakers, they take damage over time. It, it's going to happen, your speakers will wear out. And what happens though, if you keep it up at a high and loud rate, it's going to take damage. This is the diagram of a, of a sub. Sort of like on the end of my microphone slash speaker, it, it's like the part that will bounce in and out just because of sound waves just to relieve pressure. What happens is with too much distortion or too much loud, loud music, it will actually break parts inside the speaker, including springs, and also pop the, the uh, membrane that, that would be inside the speaker, which will cause distortion from your music resulting in less audio quality. Class disruption. Isn't this always a great one? You have that one kid always in class who has their headphones up and you just can't hear them. No need to point fingers because you always got five points or four pointing right back at you. Well, thumbs don't count, so that's three. But with this, um, it, it, it's, like, it's like putting up a door. And when, when you have your, your headphones all the way up, your teachers can't talk to you. Your classmates can't talk to you. And to me, when I have to pull someone's headphones out, it's just like these guys having to ram down a door to get your attention. So please, turn it down. One last thing. There's always the risk of injury. I kept the darkest one for last, but there have been plenty of occurrences. Actually, study done in 2012, Accidents with people such as him having their headphones up triple. He's part of a triple of what happened in 2012. This in, uh, incoming bus probably to this horn. He couldn't hear it. Splat. So guys, just before you decide to crank it all the way back up to 10, put those headphones in. Remember to turn it down. Thank you.